Hey everyone, welcome back to The Silver Lining here on YouTube, or welcome if you're new. I'm Sarah, and today I'm gonna be sharing with you some makeup tips and tricks that I use using my Jordan Essentials Mineral Makeup. Jordan Essentials Mineral Makeup is by far the best thing I have ever done for my face. I'm a consultant for Jordan Essentials, and I started selling in March of 2019, and one of the first things that I transitioned to was the makeup. I don't wear a lot of makeup and I don't wear makeup every day or even that often, but I knew that it is something that I wanted to be conscious of using because whatever you put on your face absorbs into your skin, absorbs into your bloodstream, and gets into your body. So using makeup and other products on my face that are safe, non-toxic, and botanically based really made a difference in my decision making. What I love about Jordan Essentials now is that it has become my one-stop shop for all products for my face, my skin, my hair, my body, and my whole family. So it is a great all-encompassing company for all of my bath and body products and my home products as well. At any rate, my husband and I were invited to go to a St. Louis Cardinals game with some friends of ours, and I'm going to share the video of me getting ready to go do that. Starting, of course, with the Age Defy Serum. I just use one squirt of that and not only does it have the benefits of age defying and in a serum, it's light so it absorbs nicely and it goes on really light and works as a primer. I'm just applying it really lightly and it's really, really silky. And then as I've said in the past, I always put any extra on the backs of my hands because your hands are the first place to show signs of aging. So don't forget your hands. Today, I'm gonna be using our BB foundation. So unlike our tinted moisturizer, it's a little bit thicker of a formula. So the coverage is a little bit more. It is the same minerals, the same tints, the colors are the same, but the BB foundation is boosted. It's a beauty boosted foundation and it's boosted with magnesium, which magnesium can help with redness and anything that's stressing your skin out. And it also has heliochrysum essential oil, a powerful essential oil, and it also has the anti-aging properties. So I just put like a squirt and a half on my brush, just the same as I do with the tinted moisturizer. You might be able to see, unlike my last video when I used the tinted moisturizer, it does have just a little bit more coverage. It does have the same mineral properties. It also includes zinc oxide, which is a natural sun reflector. So it doesn't have SPF, but zinc oxide is natural SPF in that it reflects the sun, so it does help keep from getting sunburned. I actually always use one of our mineral makeups when I'm gonna be out in the sun. So you can see I have a really nice base for the rest of the makeup. So I'm just gonna keep it super simple. I'm gonna be wearing a hat, so I don't wanna to do too much, but I am gonna use our blush cheek tint, and I will actually use this all over. I'm gonna start with my eyes, eyelids, prime my lips, so I can put a lip color on there and it will stay a bit longer. And then I'm also just going to dab my cheeks here and blend that in. I'm gonna use our brush duo just to blend. I'm 
And then I really like to use the eye fix. I use the light eye fix and I always just apply with my finger. I'm just gonna do a little bit of a highlight. Using the other side of the brush duo. And then just to set everything and sort of seal everything in, I'm gonna use our mineral powder, which is a white translucent powder. For the lip, I'm gonna use Remarkable Red. It has a little bit of a shimmer. And then another trick that I like to use with our lip color is I take the edge, the sharper edge, and just dab a tiny bit on the apples of my cheeks and rub it in just a smidge. So that's pretty much it. My hair is kind of going to stay how it is because I'm just going to put a hat on, so I'm not too concerned about that. But check the description box below to see all of the makeup that I just used and get your own easy look. Reach out if you have any questions, I'm happy to help. I hope whatever you're doing today, you feel beautiful doing it. Thank you guys so much for being here and watching. I hope you picked up some tricks or some hacks that maybe will be helpful to you in your makeup journey. Like I said, I'm not a huge makeup wearer, but when I wear makeup, I like knowing that I'm doing good things for my skin and for my body. We had so much fun at the game and I'm so appreciative to be able to have gone. I am participating in my very own Makeup Monday videos this month. In my next video, I'm going to be debuting some of the new stuff from our lookbook that we haven't had in our collection, either in a while or ever. Be sure and hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so that you don't miss the upcoming videos in this series. Stick around a while and hang out with me as I continue doing the Makeup Mondays and I'm doing a little bit of decluttering and tidying throughout the month as well. Thanks again for being here and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.